guys so today i want to do a different kind of video i am if you guys don't know i'm getting married and i thought to do this video for some brides out there brides to be out there that don't know really what to do uh for their their bridal girls are uh, like maid of honor and bridesmaid um this video is going to somewhat help you and i really hope it does i have um four of them done i have a last one to do um that i never got the chance to do i'm always like running around and i thought that i would show you guys what i did for my maid of honor and my bridesmaids now they all kind of have the same thing but my maid of honor um and you're gonna see like minor little details in there that are a bit different than my um, my bride's girls. I have all of their bags done back here. I just need to give it to them. Um, basically, I went with the black and white theme. Very, very uh, simple, very, very classy. And um, I made it in a way that they don't really know what's inside. Now, there's three girls that already know that, obviously, uh, my two sister-in-laws and one of my best friend that knows that they are in the bridal, um, in the bridal girls, but there's two girls that don't know. So, the people who don't know, this video is going to be uploaded when I actually give it to them because they watch my videos. So, I don't want them to know who uh, they are on this video. So, I'm going to upload it when I actually give it to them and that they already know what's going on. I have a few minutes with you guys to share what I have in these little bags and I want to show you what I did. So, most of the things I bought, uh, little things I kind of hand did by myself or handmade by myself, kind of like DIY. I love to uh, craft things with my hands, so I wanted to put a touch of both, like buying little things and doing little things by myself. So I'm gonna, I'll open my maid of honor, which she already knows that she's my maid of honor. So white bag again. What I did is that I uh, bought these little tags and I wrote down their names and I put like gold polka dots. Um, it's not really, my theme is not black and white and gold. Absolutely not. I mean, that's the only marker I had. I'm like, oh, I'll add gold to this. It'll be cute. <laughs> so that's what I did. A lot of things I bought, there's a few things I bought from Michael's, a few things I bought from the dollar store to kind of put all of this together. So bag, tissue paper, dollar store. And the little tag is from Michael's, if you guys are interested. Brides to be. So I'm just going to take out this and... This is what I did for them. Uh, basically, I did like a box with a letter on it and I added uh, white ribbon. And I'm going to show you the box right now because I kind of, I did the design that you see here in the background. So I want to show you that. So basically the letter right here is just basically asking them to be maid of honor slash bridesmaids. So uh, that's what it is. I'm going to show you what I wrote and it's very cute. And the white lace, it's from the dollar store. I was so lucky to find these. I'm like, oh my god, perfect. So I got that um, because um, I wanted to kind of go with the theme of my dress as well. So that's what it is. I'm not going to spoil anything <laughs> for anybody. I want you guys to see pictures and hopefully a video of my wedding because I do want to upload that to my video, to my channel, to my channel. So basically, I uh, bought these cards from Michaels and I added like a little jewel here because I have a jewel here. I'm like, oh, you know what? I'll just add a jewel. It's cute. And the jewels are from the dollar store. So I'm going to open the box up. I'll show you guys what I wrote in. Uh, this is my maid of honor. So I wrote her a little note in there. So I love these because you can get like, I got like a pack of, I think 10 cards they come with the envelopes and the card and the card says thank you on it you I know you can see my micro writing behind it but it's okay and it says thank you on it and this is what I wrote to them so I wrote plan with me laugh with me cry with me stand with me thank you for always being there for me I wrote down their name uh, will you be my maid of honor I'm just gonna cover her name because I don't want to maybe she's not comfortable to know her name online it's very simple and i basically did this letter the same letter to all of them and i kind of like played with some uh fonts with my writing and i wanted to write it because 
you know, I wanted my handwriting in there for them. So I thought it was cute. Now I was really, really hesitating about what to put in this box. I find Pinterest would be your best friend to plan anything. If you have a wedding, if you have an engagement, if you have a birthday party, just go on Pinterest and trust me, you're gonna get so much inspired just like looking at pictures and like reading descriptions and websites, you know, that you can just go on and just get inspired. You don't really need to order anything that's a bit too expensive. You can just get inspired to do something kind of like the picture. I saw a picture on Pinterest and she had like the initial or like the letter of their name and then she kind of designed the box and I'm like oh my god this is so cute so I went I bought plain boxes so the boxes look like that completely plain from the dollar store and then I went to Michael's and I wanted uh, the border because I don't know if you guys go on my channel I have like a border and then there's a lipstick inside and I love that design of like a frame border and then when I went into Michael's I found exactly the same border and I uh, bought letters to put their first letter on the box, which is really, really cute. And then I painted the border black and I painted their letters in a baby pink or like a dusky vintage pink because that's my theme. So it's basically white and vintage pink, which is like a dusky pink. So that's exactly what I did. And I found both paints from Michael's. So I just went to the crafty, woody uh, letter section and then I saw these paints and I grabbed them. They're like little tubes. I didn't buy too much because I don't, I'm not really going to be doing a lot of work with those paints after. So I'm like, you know what, I use and I'm good. So that's what it is. And then I added a jewel because it's just, it's cute. Because it was, there was a hole there and I'm like... I want to hide the hole so I added the jewel and I hot glued everything so I wanted to keep it very very simple and this is how it looks like I'm actually very very excited to give it to them you guys have no idea and I have to plan for the two girls that don't know I have to plan a dinner with them so when you open it up um, for my bridesmaid uh, I found confetti and all of uh, all of my uh, bridesmaids have white confetti. My maid of honor, I added black confetti in there because she's just, I'm just being, making her a bit different. And you're gonna see, I, I added like um, a fabric for her dress specifically to be a bit different than my girls. So I added black paper in here too. I wanted to paint the box and I'm like, no, I'm just gonna leave it like that. It's, it's way cuter. So this is what I have in their boxes so I'm just gonna show you there's like a whole bunch of cute little things in here um, so basically I'm gonna show you what I added in here I added a little soft pink US so they all kind of have the same thing as I'm showing you right now they all have the same thing except the jewelry that's a bit different and the confetti and the dress color so um, this is the EOS I bought. I found it so cute and I just had to buy them. So I bought them all the same EOS. It's a little pink uh, with the swirls on it. I also added a MAC lip gloss. This is one of my favorite glosses. It's called Ample Pink Plush Glass. So everybody wants that plump lip. So I thought, oh, good idea. I added this in there. I'm gonna show you the color uh, quick quick because it's such a pretty color. And it's kind of like in my themes as well. So that is how Ample Pink looks like. It's a very cute, soft color. I actually, you know what, funny story is that I bought it for my girls, but I don't own this color. I need to buy it <laughs> for myself. And then I bought them little Tic Tac mints and I wrote, uh, again, uh, there's a little tag. I wrote mint to be. It's so cute. And then I got them uh, small little hand sanitizers. These are so cute. I got these and I spotted them on time. Right on Christmas time, I'm like, oh, I'm just going to walk in and see. And they were perfect. So they're pink and they have like glitters inside. And then um, on here it says, on the actual packaging, it says, on Christmas we wear pink, <laughs> which is so cute. So I added a little note saying, on the wedding you wear pink so it's so so cute so that's what I I did in here and then I have for my maid of honor I want her to wear like a dusky pink kind of dress and I went to Fabricville and I got little fabrics 
uh, for all of them and I just tied down a another tag and I wrote down your dress color on it so they can go and shop their the dress color and then of course I added a ring pop in there this is actually Disney ring pop and I'm like oh my god this is so cute and it has like a heart on it so the ring pops are also different from the boxes but they're all Disney uh, ring pops so it's super adorable and then I added because I wanted because most of the girls don't really drink alcohol so I'm like oh my god instead of buying like little champagne bottles I found these and they were perfect they're actually um, not alcoholic champagne teddy bears from Swish I don't know if you guys know Swish but these are like natural candies and they're like handmade and no um, crazy chemical ingredients in there so they're extremely natural and these are the bubbly bears so basically they're the champagne bears and it's such a cute little bag that it fits perfectly in the box and then i found these at michael's i bought those little baggies to put the jewelry in it says you make my heart happy it sucks that it's not written in pink but i'm like it's okay red is my favorite color so red is perfect so you make my heart happy and then they open it up and i there's another bag in here with the jewelry so i got them jewelry from um alex and annie I don't know if you guys know this store but it's very uh, classy very simple jewelry store um, they're very like unique and different so I, I wanted to get them rings to start off with I went to Pandora but if you are a bride on a budget then I don't really recommend you to go to like Pandora or Swarovski or you know go all out but if you're like if you have a good budget you know for me I didn't really have a budget so I'm like you know what it's cute so I'm just gonna grab it but I saw these and it made so much sense to have them in my boxes because you know it's just it's it's life and like life keeps going on whomever I showed this to they're like oh my god this is so cute and you know so unique nobody does this and it's so cute so this is my maid of honor I got her uh, they all have the same exact ring but my maid of honor I bought her gold one and this is Alex and Annie and this is the path of life ring so it's super super cute and it has like the description of the ring and um, this is how it looks like so it's really really cute I really like the design very very simple so I decided to uh, get them the path of life ring so it's uh, simple so like that they don't really like they can wear it everyday basis and not worrying about making it look too much so this is what I got them and then I added in some spa coupons in here too if they want to go to the spa with me or they can go with friends so I added two um, so in here they have like massage re rebates and you know uh, night stay rebate if they want to stay there and sleep so this is really cute and it's one of my favorite spa too so I decided to put them some spa coupons and this is the black confetti in here um, you guys can see just like black confetti so yeah, this is what I have uh, in my Maid of Honor box. So basically, um, this is how their boxes look like. So it just, they have different um, letters and different colors in here, but mainly they all exactly look the same thing. So this is kind of like what I wanted to go with. Very simple, elegant, and not... Um, it's kind of like a surprise to the girls that don't know really sorry I'm like moving a lot um, but I'm super excited to just see the reaction I'm, I'm gonna try to film the reaction and maybe add it in this video just to see like um, just their reaction in general just to see how they actually react for the girls that don't know um, so I'm super super excited to uh, see and like see how they're gonna react i know maybe one of them <laughs> is going to cry because she cried when she knew that i was engaged and they're two of my closest closest friends if you are a bride to be is to choose people that means a lot to you and choose people that you know they're not only your friends but they're also kind of like your sisters like your sisters sister sisters if you have multiple sisters and um and this is i feel i feel very happy with the girls i chose and 
I am super excited to see them all at the wedding there and, and share my special day with them. So I'm super excited about that. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below. Um, so this is what I did for my girls and um, I'm excited to give it to them. One thing I can recommend you to not stress at all. I have most of the things done. I have like little minor things to do uh, that left kind of like invitation flowers and centerpieces. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really hope it was helpful and uh, if you have any questions just leave them in the comments down below. I'll try to get you guys as soon as possible. I have to say I'm sorry that I'm not posting as much. I'm honestly crazy busy. I have a lot of things to do and I have a lot of things to plan and fix and do and you know uh, appointments and a whole bunch of stuff so I say I'm sorry once all of this is eased down I'm gonna be back to track I bought awesome new palettes that I'm super excited to show you I have some reviews to show for you and you know swatches and of a lot of things that I want to show you and I can't wait to sit down and film these videos for you guys anyway I have to go I have a few minutes to sit down and show you guys my uh, how do you call these like uh, bridesmaid boxes I don't know I'll find a way to, to do a title for this video so you guys could see it thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you later bye